Jackson Page. His season hasn't got going quite yet, but we're kind of all getting going in the season. He's going to pick up pace, isn't it? And Jackson will be hoping that he'll be going deep again here in Belfast. Once again, we're looking at a big age gap, 26 years between the pair of them, and they've never played before. Yeah, it's actually this match, and we've got a feel of last night's where Mark Williams got, got the best of uh, his match and, and against a young player in Alex Sersenbacher. It, it, it's the big question, is Jackson Page game developed well enough yet to and he's a man now he's not a kid you know it's, it's time he's got he's got the, the correct schooling because he's got mark williams himself in his corner and the, the club and teaching him and probably kicking his backside the odd occasion which is good for a young player uh, you know and do this don't do that and whatever and uh, i'm really interested to see how he's progressing you know but obviously it's that it's that test Similar to Matt, he's got John, you know. Yeah, um, I mean, it was uh, he played brilliant at the Crucible. It was just a pity that he, he bumped into to Mark Williams in, in Sheffield because he really schooled him in that match. You've played Jackson before, have you? What type of a player do you see him as at this stage? I think I've played him. Um, I'm really surprised that, you know, we haven't got much better. I think the last really exceptional player to come through was Judd Trump. You know, we're always looking for new players. Was Jackson Page going to do it? Is Aaron Hill going to be that one? Luca Brussel, and they kind of hit the point and they don't really push on. So. I suppose Zhao Jintong. No, Zhao Jintong was the yeah. only one, so but he's still it. unproven. He's 25, he's not a baby anymore. Yeah, you know I, mean? I know he's won the UK and a German, but you know, look at Stephen Hendry's CV by then. I think he was on to maybe three or four world titles. So we, you, you, we're always comparing, yeah, we're, we're looking got, for the next great player. To we've got Yan Bing Tao coming through. Listen, it's he hard to see them come through when the class of 92 no, are what, still knocking around. I'm really around. surprised. You know, we're like nearly 50. It's like, is, is, is the age thing different? I don't know. I, I just can't work it out. By 32, 33, Steve David and Hendry were finished. Mm. Winning. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I'm uh, it, is, it's a, it is a mystery. Is, um, there, is it not that they're also a mystery, the class of 92, that they're dominating so much? There's nothing mysterious for me about the, the class of 92. They had the correct schooling. It was a different school, and we touched on it yesterday. Mm. Ronnie Turnham Pro, 74 out of 76 matches over one summer. You don't know it when that's happening, but for any player, it toughens you up and it hardens you up for what's to come. You have to look at it. Would a 27-year-old John Higgins lose to a 47-year-old Jackson Page. Do you get what I'm saying? You, know, you have to really look at it in that. Flip, you have flip to flip it, it over. And it's, 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 it's weird how it's going it on. It does I, weird I things to my brain I right now, work, trying to flip that. I can't work out where there's no... These young, this, a 27-year-old Jackson Page, if he is the future game, should be a big favourite against a 47-year-old Higgins in my book. OK. But he ain't. Right. For now, we'll leave it there. We'll carry on this uh, chat a little bit later. Now, if you'd like to join in on the conversation, hashtag Home Nations, uh, to get in touch, any questions you might have uh, for the guys. Hi, I'm Ronnie O'Sullivan, and welcome to Eurosport Snooker on YouTube. Click here to subscribe to Eurosport Snooker.